Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your copy and paste functionality is not working in remote desktop on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in remote desktop, best match, go back to a remote desktop connection. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to select the Show Options button, and then select the Local Resources tab. Underneath Local Devices and Resources, select the More button. And you want to make sure that Drivers is checkmarked in here. Select OK. And make sure Clipboard is also checkmarked underneath Local Devices and Resources. So again, it's very important. You want to make sure you do that, guys. And then you would proceed with the remote desktop utility, and then hopefully the problem has been resolved at this point. If you're still having a problem, you can try right-clicking on the taskbar and select Task Manager. If you want to search up in the top the RDPCLIP folder, so the RDPCLIP. If you don't see one in here, that's fine. Otherwise, if you found one, you'd want to end that task by right-clicking on it and select End Task, or you can select the End Task button. And once you've ended it, you want to now go ahead and create it again. So select Run New Task, and you want to type in RDP. C L I P and then you want to select OK. And then hopefully I would have been able to resolve the problem. One further thing too, if you have Windows 10 or Windows 11 Professional or Higher Edition, it'd be to open up the search menu, type in local group policy, best match, you come back with edit group policy, go ahead and open that up. You want to double click on the computer configuration section if it's not already expanded here, so it's a top group. And then you want to double click on the Administrative Templates folder. Do the same thing now for the Windows Components folder. And then you want to go down to Remote Desktop Services and double click on that. And it should be a Remote Desktop Session Host. Double click on that one as well. And then Locate where it says Device and Resource Redirection. And now on the right side where it says Do Not Allow Clipboard Redirection, double click on it. I selected the wrong one, select the Do Not Allow Clipboard Redirection. And you want to set that to either Disabled or Not Configured. If it's currently enabled, you would do not want to keep it at that. Obviously, you want to either Disable that or Not Configured. And then you want to select Apply and OK. And that's all you have to do. So pretty straightforward process, guys. So once you've done that, you would need to restart your computer. Let's just go ahead and actually do that here for demonstration purposes. So there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do a buzz able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.